Hello everyone, it's Stephanie Manley with copycat.com and today I'm going to show you how to make a coffee liqueur. A brand for this is Kahlua and you know what, it's easy to make at home and it tastes really, really good. So let's get started. We're going to start by measuring out two cups of sugar and to this we're going to add in about one teaspoon of vanilla and um, I'm just using Kirkland brand, it's a great value. This helps give this liqueur a special flavor. And then I'm gonna add in two cups of warm water. Now I warmed up two cups of water in my tea kettle and we use the warm water to get the sugar to dissolve. Now we don't put in the vodka right now because if we did, some of it might escape and evaporate and we wouldn't want that to happen. So we're gonna go ahead and add in one tablespoon of espresso powder. Now, I actually think that if you like it a little bit more mild, you might wanna use instant coffee. Or if you're a real coffee connoisseur, you might wanna do a little mix of coffee and espresso powder, or two different types of espresso powder. I think this way you get a much more rich coffee flavor, but completely up to you, one tablespoon of espresso powder. I found it at Walmart, so it wasn't hard to find. We're gonna give this a stir, and when everything gets mixed up really well, we're gonna leave it alone for a little bit, just to let it cool off. And then we're gonna add in about two and a half cups of vodka. Now, I'm not using an expensive vodka at all. I'm using a very inexpensive one, because you know what? We're mixing it with sugar and coffee and vanilla. So if it's not the highest quality of vodka, no one's gonna notice because there's all these other flavors that are gonna compete with it. Um, you know what, it might even be great to try this with a vanilla vodka as well. Definitely think that could be good. So two and a half cups of vodka goes in here. Um, I'm using Prime brand. Now I did read recently that Popov actually gets rated as an A minus, and that's actually sold on the bottom shelf in a plastic jug. Um, it's a very neutral flavor, so it'd be perfect for this. So two and a half cups of vodka goes in here and we're just gonna give this a stir. And then we're gonna put it in a wine bottle, a 750 mil wine bottle. And um, that's where I'm gonna store it. Now I am actually gonna keep this inside of my refrigerator. Um, I think that's a good idea to do with liqueurs because things could happen if your house is a little bit warm. Um, it could turn, the sugars are still active and they could, mold on you or do something that's unexpected unexpected and give you a bad flavor um so i'm just gonna put this in a 750 ml bottle and i'm just gonna put a um, cork in it this makes more than 750 mils i will tell you that it probably makes about a thousand mils or so so you're gonna have plenty to sample when you're done so try it with some of those Colorado Bulldogs, a Paralyzer, a Mudslide, or you know, just Kahlua and Cream, or if you're like me, you just put it in your coffee. And how does it taste? I gotta tell you, it tastes pretty good. Um, definitely a great homemade liqueur to dry. Super easy. So listen, I appreciate you watching this video. Drop me a comment down below of what you'd like to see next. Thanks so much for watching.